like two guys with a camera buying food models. <laughs> it's weird. We're gonna we have a foot fetish. So we're going to Dung Moon right now. I'm going to buy a few items for one of my partners in the States so he can do a like a little little showing of Kimpy Sock products so you can just see like kind of like the day in the life of, of a sock hustler. All right, so we just bought four of these foot models <laughs> to be used for sock displays. I don't go there no more. That lady was a mean. All this made in Korea? Okay. So that's important for the brand since we say kimchi socks made in Korea. So not only are the socks, but I want everything else to be made in Korea as much as possible. In today's time, it's very important to build a community around what you're selling to people. So with kimchi socks, essentially my whole brand is about uh, a foreigner like myself coming over here and creating a, pretty much an international company that believe in not just selling you socks, but selling you a lifestyle, selling you socks that has meaning. Once you have established a very solid community, when I mean solid, I mean a community that trusts you, a community that has your loyalty, a community that will do anything to support your brand. Anybody can copy you, but they can't take that community from you because you put in the hard work, you put in the time, you made videos like this, you was tweeting them, responding to the tweets, you was, you was responding back to their Instagram comments, you was like keeping engaged with them. You built that relationship. So that's what I mean by building your community is building that relationship with who you want to buy your product. Well, I created the Black Power Sock and the red in the sock represent the blood of the people who came before us, the blood of the, uh, the black entrepreneurs who made it through slavery, who made it through oppression, and they created multi-million dollar companies which made them become millionaires. This is, the red is, it shows their hard work, their sacrifice, the blood, sweat, and tears that they lost to build their companies during times where people didn't want them to succeed, but instead they proved them wrong and they succeeded. The Black Fist represent that strength, that confidence, and that courage that they had to endure what they endured in order to become a success through all the hardships. So whenever someone say, oh, Black Power, they think negative. No, it's not a negative thing that I'm selling. I'm selling here. I'm selling a positive thing.